Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel. This week's plan with me isn't going to be using a kit, I'm just using some character stickers and some other random stickers. I hope you guys are keeping safe and you're all well and not going too crazy in this quarantine. Let me know how you're getting on down below. I'm going to be starting um, day by day as I normally do and I'm taking my puppet checklists to create a checklist and I'm doing this on every morning of each day. And for Monday, I wanted to film this plan with me. I actually got up super early and because my children went up, I decided to film this about seven in the morning. So the clouds do keep coming over and adjusting my lights. So I apologize. I did quickly make some character stickers for my children. So I have one for my daughter, one for my middle son, and then I created a younger character for my youngest son. Um, so for their schoolwork, Ellie was going to be revising for hey, her, hey, hey, bleh, that was a cross between her and a, um, a test. Harvey was going to be doing flashcards and then my son was going to be doing some German. I used a sticker from Philo Fabulous, which was too much to go for a walk. I also created these switch puppets that I was just kind of checking them out. I was testing them in this week's plan with me. There are a few adjustments that I want to make, but these will be coming up into my shop soon. And then heading over to Tuesday, I'm doing the same thing, creating a puppet checklist. It's actually my son's 16th birthday today. <laughs> which, you know, is great considering we're under quarantine and can't do anything. Also, I was wrapping his presents um, about midnight last night and I realised I didn't have any wrapping paper. <laughs> so I could just nip out to the shop to go and get some. Um, so I used tin foil <laughs> and it was quite hilarious. He found it really funny as well. I blamed it on this coronavirus, of course, um, but he was fine with it. It was just really funny trying to wrap presents with tin foil because tissue is way too precious. So tinfoil it was. Um, but I just used some birthday poppets and wrote happy 16th. I then used this Charlotte Designs silver bow to mark that we won't be, that we won't, I can't talk today, I'm sorry, that we won't be doing any schoolwork. And as a little treat, we're going to be having a pizza night. For Wednesday, I'm just starting with my checklist and I wanted to do a voiceover for my bullet journal video and then upload it. I also want to design and charge the battery for the camera. Then I'm going to move on to the middle section, which I'm kind of using as my children's work section. So again, I'm just using the character stickers that I made for them. My daughter will be doing an English paper. My middle son will be doing a math worksheet. And then my youngest is going over physics, um, the words and their meanings and spellings. And then moving to the bottom section, I used one of the house functional stickers from my shop to write down the home skills that I will be teaching. And for Wednesday, it's going to be gardening. And then at the bottom there, I'm using one of the poppet phones to mark that I'm going to be calling my nan and my auntie Faye. And then hopping over to the second half of the week on Thursday, again, I'm starting with a checklist up at the top. I've just done it this way. So then when you look at it, it does look like a coordinated spread because all of my checklists are at the top so even though I'm not using a kit to pull everything together I just thought it might look more cohesive if all things were the same on each day I don't know <laughs> that was my thinking um I want to design there's emails I need to go through I want to sort through my files on the computer because they are very unorganized there's lots of things in there that I don't know what they are so I think it's a good time to just sit and go through them all, get rid of things that I don't need, put them into order, that kind of thing. I'm also pretty sure there's a way that you can get a thumbnail picture for each file that you have on your PC. So instead of just having the yellow folder looking thing, you can make that into a picture. I can't remember how, I'm going to look into it, but that's super cute. Anyway, <laughs> um, also on Thursday, I'm going to be FaceTiming my family in the USA. And then for the home skills on Thursday, I'm going to be teaching my children to touch type. So typing without looking at the keyboard. And then for Friday, I have my to-do list at the top. My daughter is going to be going through her English results and going over things that she may have got wrong or wanted to extend. And same with my son with maths. And then my younger son will be doing English too. I also created these um, text stickers, which I'll be putting up in the shop. Um, so for Friday, 
um, afternoon I'm going to be going food shopping for my mum and dad as they are high risk and in quarantine and obviously my nan and then for home skills it was budgeting like a basic how to budget whether that's money or like anything just budgeting and then for Saturday I'm going to be putting my new release up I didn't have a new release last week so I wasn't sure what I was going to be doing with my shop or everything was a bit up in the air but I am still going to put a new release up this week um I will then need to do a shopping list for myself, call my sister and then go shopping for us, for our household. So I've put a little food poppet there. And then again from Philo Fabulous, I'm using the trainers to mark that we are going to go as a walk as a family. Again with the poppet switch stickers as I'll spend the afternoon playing on the switch with my children and then doing some laundry at the bottom. For Sunday's checklist, I just want to get some housework done. I want to go through and print any schoolwork ready for next week that they need online and come up with a plan for next week too. And then I took one of the Poppet Code stickers. I haven't used these for a while, but it was just to mark that my children need to write a letter to their nan and auntie Faye. And then we'll be having some family time and watching probably something on Netflix, although I'm tempted to do the Disney Channel. <laughs> I'll probably do the Disney Channel. After that, I want to film next week's plan with me. And then in the late afternoon, if I've got time, then it will be Sims 4 time. Hopping over to the sidebar, I just used a sticker that come off of one of my freebies that says I have a sticker for that. I have lots of freebies that um, I need to use up because I have all of the offcuts that kind of happen in my shop if there's any that have off cut or just completely gone a bit wrong but the stickers are semi okay and able to use I'll just keep them for me to use in my planner so normally all of the poppets that you see me use there's something kind of half wrong with them <laughs> but I just use them so I'm not throwing them away the treat yourself was a sticker from a happy planner book I treated all the children last week um, my daughter bought clothes which should be arriving this week, my middle son bought Stardew Valley and my younger son bought a game called Rust for the PC. And then at the bottom I wanted to just keep track of the meals. Um, I thought I had meals up until Friday because then on Saturday I'm going food shopping and then as I was filling this out I was one short and I got very confused but I realised that I put a meal down on Tuesday whereas that should have been pizza for Harvey's birthday. So just move one along and I have got them all up until Friday. So panic over. I've got enough food for this week. <laughs> but that was it for this week's plan with me. I hope you guys have enjoyed it. If you did, then make sure you give me a thumbs up. And as always, I will speak to you next Tuesday. Bye, everyone.